Now, I'm not going to put the ball on. I made a few, I don't know if you've ever seen them. I made a ball mount that fits on here. So if I got to move the trailer any distances or anywhere, um, or jockey it around, it's going to be on here for a while. I just put the ball mount on and sticks out. And there's also a top piece where another one slides in. Then, what bolts in there is a long piece. It's about uh, two and a half feet or so long. It's a bar, round. And then it's got a piece of PVC, PVC pipe on it and the bottom part. And then it comes up. And then this way, if I want to raise or lower the tower, the tower fits right into it. So when I back up or go forward, and then the PVC pipe turns, so it's not dragging. I made that. Good. Ray uh, was in the Navy, and he was on the uh, USS Thor. And uh, he had, well, they were on a ship, I think I told you. And they were just recently able to talk about it. But uh, they were on a ship back then, uh, USS Thor. And they were tucked in behind an island that was being bombed uh, and fought on. Uh, and at that point, uh, you know, all the, the smoke and Agent Orange and all that shit was going and blowing across the top of the water and in the air and on top of all that they get a message from the big shots saying if they are found out in other words if the enemy sees them because of the technology that was on the boat that they were going to sink it friendly fire so basically they were all sacrificing themselves if they were caught luckily they weren't spotted, so they didn't have to worry about that. Anyway, the, him and his bride, his wife, Terry, went to, um, they went on vacation, and they're spending two weeks on, an, on a naval base. Uh, I don't know where, but I'm sure I'll see some pictures and talk about it over coffee when they get back. They're coming back tomorrow night, so. All right, let me get this thing going. was them again. I told them to enjoy. Well needed, yes. Okay. All right, let's get this tractor over there. I'm not going to get things done by texting back and forth.
I was going to hook it to the bottom tube, but I'd rather hook it up here next to the uh, pin, only because uh, I'd have to make it, I'd have to bring it up, the bucket up too high. on the other side. Do I have anything under there? I may, but I don't think I needed it, so I don't think, no, I didn't. The only thing I need to do is something with those weeds. Okay. Uh, I don't know about you guys, but even if you have a yard tractor, lawn tractor, something like that one, and you have a little trailer, or even, I moved this big one and the other one with that. However, it's easier to maneuver the trailer if you hook it up to the front. One is, you can see it. It handles much better as far as your left and rights, and um, it just... It's ten times better. You don't have to worry about it. But you're going to have to make some kind of a ball mount or something up. You want to put it on a ball. You just want to use the chains. That's all I'm using now. It gets a little rocky and sloppy. All right, so that's going to stay there. Let me drop that bucket the rest of the way so there's no tension on it. There. Okay. Oh, so here's the other lights I was looking for. But, uh, oh, I got one on the other side, too. So what the hell am I doing? Huh. I'm going to have to test them. Well, I know they're not wired, so I'm going to test them right here. I'll run 12 volts out here and take care of it. Yeah, okay, this may be easier than I expected. And this one, what was I doing with this one? I don't remember. Well, for now, I'm just going to leave it there. I'm not going to concern myself with it. 
Okay. Do I care about the running lights? Nah. Reflectors will be fine. Oh, here's baby's blanket. Why is that back here? Here's your plank. All right. So, so what? Uh, um, okay, so that's doing this thing. It's there if I need it. I can probably just use it as a backup light. But anyway, uh, these may or may not work. Maybe that's why they're not hooked up. I remember running the wire one day. It's even a video on it if I remember right. And I couldn't get them to to work. And I'm wondering if I just said the hell with it and stopped. Who's that? Uh, okay. Um, I got. I don't. Rem no, there's no wire coming up here. Okay. So I need a wire as long as that trailer. Let's see what we have. I don't want to cut up an extension cord. Oh, you know what I can use? No, oh, what can you use? Uh, well, it's a three conductor, but I could probably get away with this speaker wire. I don't have to use the other stuff. Huh, huh baby? Let's see if this is long enough for a test. Let's see. Let me get a uh, first reverse. Da, 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 da. Hey, baby. Baby, baby. Baby, baby. Yeah, I put these on here. I don't know if I showed you those or not. Uh, this here way, if I want to pull something up on the trailer and not have it hooked, or I don't want to put a lot of pressure on the ball I can put those down stabilize it different and then at that point pull up if I'm connected to the ball or not uh, and then what else did I do oh I welded these plates on here so I can use them for tie downs I think I have three on each side if I remember right one I thought I had three. Oh yeah one two and up there on the top, three, one, two, and three. So I can use them for chaining and stripping down. I can chain and strap down. There. Let's put you right here for now.